Hello, and welcome to Drinking and Drawing with Wayne. I'm Wayne, your host. I am the cartoonist of a recently started comic strip called Wayne Duck Nation. My latest comic attempt. Um, sometimes you get stories, and they kind of develop into something. This is something that kind of developed along the way over the past few weeks, and has developed into a daily four-panel, five-panel comic strip that I do on a daily basis. I have a lot of them. The idea I have behind it now is to turn that comic strip into a monthly comic book. Why not? It's pretty much the same thing in how comic books actually got started, so why not go along with that, a little bit of the old and the new. So here I have a script that's not part of the daily script. So in the comic book, I would definitely want to add things that would be different than, say, the normal comic strips we normally see every day, every, you know. So I'm doing my own take, my own style. This is just me relaxing a bit. Make it a little easier to tell my lines on this layer from that line. So let's see, we got them kind of leaning forward. Maybe arms crossed a little bit on the table. Blocking it in. Just some simple shapes here. We're going to do the head now. He's a duck. I like this. I like drawing a duck. Ducks, I kind of like um, Daffy Duck, Donald Duck. You know, it's, it's an American cartoon character we do a lot in this country. It's ducks. We love ducks. They're goofy. They're kooky. They're fun to feed bread. Now we got some lines here. Give him some of his glasses. Which became his signature. I, I kind of like him in glasses. I don't know why. News anchor, I guess. Walter Concrete and all that. So we're just going to have him sitting at the desk. Okay, welcome to Lame Duck Nation. I am your host, Mallard Drake. Now here, smaller panel. We're going to introduce his name. I definitely want to go more dramatic so we're just going to get the eyes shape in here I don't want to be a smile here so we're just going to draw out the beak keeping my lines loose fluid Hairstyle, a little bob here, and a little ducky tie, and then we'll go ahead here. Mallard Drake. I think it's a little too big, so we're just going to go ahead and lasso it, and we're just going to shrink that down a little bit. The word and ratio between words and image. So we're trying to correlate to create our composition. So here we have this. Gonna maybe make him a little bit small, but we'll work on that when it gets to the script page. Right now, this is just thumbnailing, figuring out what we're gonna do. We will go on a journey together. Rough shape of the beak in, and then I can control my neck. I like him in a turtleneck. I don't know why, I just think it's funny. Get the hair in. Very loose, just shaping it in. Let's have him holding his hand up here. A little action. Just get some shaping of the hand going on there. This arm is still kind of folded over. He's at the desk, of course. Give him the classic coffee mug that all they all have with the show's name on it. Lame Duck Nation right there. A little bit of a chair. A little comfier looking chair here. Just a little right there. Okay, so tonight we're going to go on a journey. Let's see, what do I got to do? Now here he's talking to somebody though. 
this is gonna give the, this is his producer says all show has it and I kind of like this character a bit so I'm gonna you know all these shows have producers DMs you know who kind of run behind the scenes for everything and keep the actors and whatnot on performing for director edgy Let's get the arm in here we got Headset in. And there we go. Got the audience going on here. Let's get in. Well. in here get the head in now a lot of people say how do you, how do you draw them that quickly in that firm thing it's practice you're developing these characters so I learned my little shortcuts on how the head looks how the shape is and see what you want to do with this body you want to Put him in a relaxed pose, maybe arms crossed. So we're just gonna cross the arms here. Just give him a little quick outline. That's all we need. Give us a little idea of where it's going. Really grabs the attention. So does sex, drugs, and rock and roll. Does it make it news? Get the neck in. A bit more reaction here. Streaming a little bit here. He's trying to make his point. You can go to extremes these days for that. Very cartoonish. So that's what we're going to do here. Get the hand in. Some fingers. Get the thumb in. Boop, 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 boop. There we go. Maybe a little bit hint of a leg. There. So does this, that, and that, and this. You want good or money? I need a new car. So let's see. So we're just trying to figure out body position. Body language really tells a lot of the joke. You know, you can just have a circle with some angry eyes or something, but the language comes from the emotion. You want to keep it loose in this situation. She's being flippant. Let's see. Set in there, that's good. Do that. And there we go. And there we have it. Now we can take away that, and we just got whoop, little goof up there. And we 
got what we have in character. So I'm going to just go ahead and take this because we know we're going to want to make that bigger. Bring it down a bit more. So we have room up here for the words. Now we want to think about positioning and lettering and all that. That will be another episode of Wild Wayne Draws. Get everything kind of down on an equal level here. Just put that in there right there. And now we're just going to kind of give it, give it a line here so we can break this up. So we're going to have like three, five panels all together. Right there, five panels to tell this little joke and introducing this whole thing. Now, I kind of have a logo in mind. Lame duck nation it uh, Lame Duck Nation logo up there. And there we have it. Introducing Mallard Drake, Lame Duck Nation comic. You'll be seeing this exclusively in the first issue of Lame Duck Nation. Uh, I'm calling this issue Debate Debacle. And you will see this turned into a comic book page from here. Until next time, stay wild, stay loose, keep drawing, and have a joy.